Well, good morning. Google have been testing the self-driving or autonomous car on the streets of San Francisco for several years. And now Nissan have announced they will have a commercially viable autonomous or self-driving car available by 2020. So when they offered me a chance to ride in one, I jumped at it. Autonomous mode activated. These vehicles will drive themselves on streets or highways. They will make lane changes, avoid collisions, utilizing a number of current and next generation technologies. Nissan's executive vice president Andy Palmer told journalists that the automaker is committed to bring these cutting edge technologies to a larger market, as it did with the all electric Nissan Leaf. Uh, we've announced that we'll uh, introduce autonomous drive vehicle by uh, 2020 and that we said that within two, two, two vehicle life cycles we'll make that technology available across the entire portfolio. Nissan is already working on a proving ground in Japan for the technologies which use laser scanners, around view monitor cameras as well as advanced intelligence and actuators to ease traffic and allow multitasking while commuting. Six million accidents occur in the US alone each year with some 93 percent attributed to human error. In addition to safety for the aged and those with disabilities, Autonomous Drive offers another benefit, true independence and mobility for all. Nissan is working with institutions such as Oxford, MIT, Stanford and the University of Tokyo on next generation development. Autonomous Drive vehicles will be going beyond models like the Nissan LEAF with new models coming in the future and will be going from an era of what if to an era of what is. I'm Nick Miles.